Hi folks, this is Madison S. with MyPracticeTestPrep.com and this is the second video in the free training series, Secrets to Passing the CLEP, the fastest and easiest way to prepare and pass the introductory sociology CLEP exam guaranteed. Now remember, in the first video we covered what is the CLEP and why should you take it. In this video, we're going to cover what's on the intro sociology CLEP and where to find the best free study guides. And then in the third video, we're going to cover secrets to passing the intro sociology club and where to find the best free practice test. So with that being said, let's go ahead and get started on the second video in the three part training series. Now we have a lot of information to cover in a short amount of time, so I have to talk really fast. But you can always rewatch this video or read the unabridged version on my website at bit.ly backslash clap sociology. Now that is case sensitive, so please be sure to use all lowercase to get to the correct place. And if you're ever wondering where you can watch all three free training videos, the secrets to passing the CLEP introductory sociology, you can find them at bit.ly backslash CLEP sociology one, two, or three. Again, that is case sensitive, so please use all lowercase. So with that being said, now let's go ahead and get started. Now before I show you the fastest and easiest way to prepare and pass the CLEP exam, to be completely transparent, I just want to tell you that the official CLEP study recommendation can always be found on their website at clep.collegeport.com. So I just want to make it perfectly clear that what I'm about to tell you is the unofficial CLEP study guide that will show you how to shortcut all the fluff that I promise you you'll find on the College Board website and only focus on the key points needed to pass the CLEP exam. Because your goal is to test out of these required general and introductory level courses that your college makes you take as fast and easy as possible so you can get to the classes that are really important for your degree and your career while saving a whole bunch of time and money at the same time. And let me just say something to my critics right now because I respect the whole liberal arts educational model and think these classes are important to any quote unquote well rounded college graduate. But I just don't believe I should have to do 16 weeks worth of busy work and spend hundreds and thousands of dollars in college tuition to prove what I already know, or at least can study for in a few short weeks. And I believe that the independent study model offers just as much value to a person's education as a traditional brick and mortar classroom because number one, it teaches you how to be an independent learner, which is important to any college graduate. Number two, testing out of general and introductory level courses frees your schedule to explore other courses of interest or more advanced courses in your degree. Three, it allows students to graduate faster, or on time for that matter, so you can jumpstart your career and begin your real world learning. And last, but certainly not least, my favorite, it allows students to save tens of thousands of dollars in college tuition and student loan debt. Heck, with the money saved, you can buy yourself a library if you're that motivated to learn. Now, if I'm preaching to the choir, I apologize. I had to waste your time with that rant. But there are a lot of days that criticize me for spreading a message that can really help a lot of college students for the reasons I just listed. So I just want to set the record straight. I believe education is important, but I do not, I do not believe in a one-size-fits-all educational model. And the CLEP exam can help students do just that. So with that being said, now let's get started. About the CLEP sociology exam, most students say you can probably pass the intro sociology CLEP test on common sense alone. This is one of those few CLEP exams that several hours of studying will be more than sufficient to pass the CLEP sociology test, even if you have little or no prior knowledge on the subject. Now, I don't want to give you any false confidence because you'll still need to study, but with the best sociology CLEP study guides and the best sociology CLEP practice test, you will be able to test out of your sociology class in a matter of days, not weeks. Many students also credit the CLEP test as one of the best ways to pay for college tuition. And given that the cost of the CLEP test is probably less than the cost of your sociology college textbook for the class anyway, and that you'll spend a fraction of the time studying than you would in a traditional 16-week sociology course, it's a social good, chuckle chuckle, that clepping out of college classes will save you both money in college tuition and time in the classroom. What topics are covered on the CLEP sociology test? The Sociology CLEP exam covers a wide range of material that is normally taught in a first semester intro to sociology undergrad course. The exam covers basic terms, concepts, theories, and methodologies 
that are used by sociologists to study society and its influences on humans. This includes social behavior and social change. You are not required to have any highly specialized knowledge in order to take or pass the sociology clap exam. I usually tell people that clap exams are designed to be self-study and even someone with no prior knowledge or background can pass the exam in just a few short weeks and sometimes even days of studying. And that's definitely the case with this particular exam. And so I'm going to show you in the next section the fastest and easiest way to take and pass the exam. For the CLEP sociality test, you will have 90 minutes to answer 100 multiple choice questions covering five sociology subtopics, including institution, social patterns, social process, social stratification, and social perspective. Sociology CLEP test secrets. They ask about some guy named Berger. I couldn't seem to remember the guy, so look him up. A past CLEP test taker. Now, I put that on, I put that quote on this slide because that pretty much sums up this exam. Because the key to this CLEP is terms, 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 and more terms. For most CLEP exams, I usually get on your case about just memorizing terms without understanding the concepts. But this is one CLEP exam that's an even split between memorization and critical thinking. You are going to want to memorize the major sociology players, theories, concepts, and terminology. Also knowing basic statistical terms like mean, median, and mode, so we're not talking anything advanced here, this is all stuff you've probably learned in elementary, and social trends such as percentage of children living below the poverty line and the ratio of pay for men versus women, etc., will help you pick up a few extra easy points on the exam. Another key to this clip is do not go overboard studying. Remember, you are tested on your knowledge of introductory level sociology material. You can study sociology through your whole bachelor's, master's, and even doctor's program. But the CLEP Introductory Sociology Exam is a lower level undergraduate course that only expects you to know a basic or introductory, which is the title of the exam, concept. So unless this is your declared major, don't go crazy studying. One or two weeks max studying. And, you know, if this is your declared major, then sure, you're probably going to overstudy because I've done that on some exams that were... Um, related to my particular course, but for everybody else, unless this is your declared major, don't go overboard. One or two weeks max, pass the exam, earn the college credit, and move on. Most schools only award a pass-fail credit anyway, so if you guess on a few of the harder questions, it won't be the end of the world. Now, to sum up the secrets to passing this club, mostly memorization and common sense will get you through this exam. Testing out of college classes is easier than you think. Now, I know all this information may seem overwhelming at first. You may think that it's just easier to take the course at your college instead. But trust me, just use the Sociology Club study guide and the Sociology Club practice test provided in this free video training series, and testing out of college classes will be easier than you think. Not to mention a great way to help you pay for college and earn your degree faster. How do I study for the club Sociology test? To study for the CLEP exam, the College Board, the makers of the test, recommend you read several, several 800 plus page college sociology textbooks. Now that was the fluff I was telling you about earlier. And that's a daunting task even for the most studious overachievers who really wants to read through all that boring text. So no wonder so many students believe the myth, it's a myth that I'm a bust, but right now it's a myth that testing out of college classes is actually harder than just taking the damn class. And so in the next few slides, I'm going to show you a quick overview of, of what's on the sociology clap exam. Now don't freak out, because like I said, I'm gonna bust the myth afterwards, but I just wanna show you a quick overview of what's on the exam. And for more details, you can go to my website at bit.ly backslash clap sociology, all lowercase. So remember there's five sections. So you're going to have 20 questions on institutions like family, politics, religion. You're going to have 15 questions on social patterns like community, demographics, rural versus urban. You're going to have 20 questions on social processes like culture, groups, interaction. 
You're going to have about 30 questions on social stratification, like age, race, sex, etc. You're going to have about 15 questions on social perspective, like history, method, and theories. Now, now, again, don't freak out because I'm about to bust the math. So, you know, you probably, if you're just starting your studying, you're probably freaking out because you're like, oh my God, I don't know any of that. But by the end of this video, trust me, I'll give you the tools that that will be simple for you. All right. But if you need that list again, you can go to my website at bit.ly backslash clep sociology. Now, like I said, at first glance, that may all look really, really scary. And that's why I said, don't freak out. Because the truth is, CLEP tests were designed to be self-study for any student with the motivation and desire to pass the CLEP exam. So that's why I put together the fastest and easiest way to prepare and pass the sociology CLEP test. First, I usually recommend students use the Instant Search CLEP Study Guide because it is the fastest and easiest way to prepare and pass the introductory sociology CLEP test. I personally use Instant Search because it's like having your college professor's private classroom notes to study for the sociology final exam. Look, there's a lot of information out there that can help you prepare for the CLEP introductory sociology test. And I'm going to give you some free web resources shortly. But trust me, because I've taken dozens of CLEP and DATES exams, and I can tell you that using a premium service like Instant Search is the fastest and easiest way to prepare and pass the CLEP introductory sociology test guaranteed. There's no prior knowledge or background required. You do, not, you do not have to read hundreds of pages of fluff like the College Board wants you to do or spend hours researching the internet because Instant Search will give you a solid foundational knowledge necessary to pass the CLEP exam. By spoon feeding you only the main points through their interactive learning format, they are able to keep your mind engaged and processing the information. So you are able to prepare and pass the introductory sociology test in a matter of days, not weeks. And thousands of successful past test takers will agree. Instant was not only their secret weapon to passing the sociology club, but also their only club study guide needed. You can watch my full Instant review video at bit.ly backslash IC review. Again, all lowercase. And as a special bonus, I've secured you a $5 discount off your first month. Just use Instant Search discount code 3014 2 and you'll get $5 off your first month membership just for giving them a try. Now, after you reviewed a premium intro sociology club study guide service like Instant Search, free online preparation, preparation resources serve as a great supplement, bold underline, and I'll explain later what I mean by that to your studies because Instant Search will give you a solid foundational knowledge necessary to pass the CLEP, but supplemental reading will give you that extra confidence boost needed to improve your CLEP test score. Now with that being said, I couldn't find a good, free, specific, and in-depth CLEP sociology study guide. The stuff that was all out there was garbage and I wouldn't even feel comfortable recommending it to you. So what I did was I took the syllabus of the typical sociology undergrad course, which is what the exam is based on, by the way. And then I took the syllabus of the CLEP sociology exam. And then I went out and spent hours and hours researching the Internet for the best free sociology web resources. Now, I'm talking 10 hours here. So I imagine that, A, you don't have that type of time. And B, why would you even want to try and reinvent that well? And so what I said is I'll put it all together in one resource. For everybody to download so you don't have to go out there and reinvent the wheel yourself and i'm willing to give it away for free no catch or strings attached just go to my website bit.ly backslash club sociology all lowercase and about two-thirds down the page you'll see my three-step sign up form to download my free secrets to passing the club introductory sociology club study guide and club practice test now i will give you a word of caution it's a lot of information that is not as neatly organized as Instant Search. And what I mean by that, you know, there's a lot of fluff. It's going to be information overload. So you might get scared off at first. But please don't. I do not want you to think your way out of taking the exam because you believe in it that testing out of college is actually harder than just taking the class because it's not. Because you don't have to know everything to pass the class. That's why I do not recommend using it without Instant Search. 
because it's information overload and it'll cause you to go into the exam with your head ready to explode. So use it as a supplement only to instant cert. Remember, instant cert will skip the fluff and spoon feed you only the main points needed to pass the exam. This supplemental reading will help kind of fill in some of those gaps or filling things that you might feel that you need more information on. Again, for a in-depth review of InstaCerts, you can go to my website or watch the video at bit.ly backslash review. And remember, I secured you a special discount code just for giving them a try of 3014.2 and that'll get you $5 off your first month membership. This concludes the end of this video. Whether you're just starting your studying or wrapping up, I just want to tell everybody good luck fellow club test takers. Because whether you watch all three videos in the series or just one or two, you're already well ahead of the curve. And so by the end of this three-part series, I would have told you everything I know to help you prepare and pass the introductory sociology club test. Now the rest is up to you. So go get her done. My name is Madison S. with MyPracticeTestProp.com. What to do next? If you haven't already done so, you're going to want to watch all three parts in the video training series, Secrets to Passing the Club, Introductory Sociology. You can find any of those at bit.ly backslash club sociology 1, 2, or 3. Remember that is case sensitive, so please be sure to use all lowercase. These are the three important links mentioned throughout the video training series. If you haven't already done so, you're going to want to write them down and go visit them immediately. Number one, you're going to want to download my free Secrets to Passing the Club Introductory Sociology at bit.ly backslash club sociology. Number two, you're going to want to watch my Instant Cert Club Study Guide Review at bit.ly backslash IC Review. And remember, I secured you a special discount code, 3014.2, where if you use that code, you get $5 off your first month membership just for giving them a try. And number three, when you finish up your studies, you're going to want to take one of the practice tests, and you can find some of those at amzn.to backslash club book or amzn.to backslash RIA Sociology. Also, if you liked this video and you thought it was really helpful, please be sure to comment, rate, share, and subscribe to this page or video. Because that's what tells Google and YouTube that this is a really good video that can help other students learn how to pay for college by testing out of college. By spreading the message to your family and friends, you help keep this content free for all. Bonus, more great ways to pay for college. Look folks, I am out of time on this video training, so please be sure to pause the video write down the links and go visit them immediately because I give you more great ways to help you find money to pay for college through your traditional financial aid, scholarships who can turn down free money, our good old friend student loans, and college coupons and deals that you can't resist. Feature Sponsor I like to thank everyone for watching and I also like to thank the sponsors of this video that help keep this content free for you. The feature sponsor of this video is Prosper, America's leading social lending marketplace. I chose them after I heard an interesting news radio program on NPR the other day where Prosper Marketplace was a way to connect people who wanted to invest money with people who wanted to borrow money. So basically, instead of going to a big corporate bank for a personal loan, you would post your loan request on Prosper Marketplace and watch as dozens of members invest together to get you the money you need. Or you could be one of those investors yourself. And this is all done in a safe social lending marketplace. It's an innovative concept where people invest, borrow, and prosper. Please be sure to check out our sponsor at bit.ly backslash prosperlending and tell them Madison sent you. Well, that's it for me. Peace and love to all.